I'm glad to tell you tonight that Jesus Christ, the Son of God, has an answer to every problem that you face. Jesus Christ, the Son of God, has an answer to every burden that you carry. He says, if you're going to follow me, you have to call me master. You have to make me Lord and master of your life. Then he said, you have to follow me. You have to obey me in the fellowship of my church. All the way through the scripture you will, or the New Testament, you will find these words. The blood of Jesus Christ. The blood of Jesus Christ. The blood of Jesus Christ. The blood of Jesus Christ, his son, cleanseth us from all sin. He meant that you have to deny yourself. That part of you that is always interested in me and mine. The I, the ego. He said, if any man is to follow me, he'll have to deny self. And then he'll have to take up a cross. He'll have to come and be willing to die with me, no matter what it costs. He is not here. He has conquered the grave. He's alive. And ladies and gentlemen, I believe that there's more proof that Jesus Christ rose from the dead than almost any other fact in Roman history. I'm going to ask you to get up out of your seat right now, hundreds of you, and come and stand in front of the platform and say by coming, I want Jesus Christ to forgive my sin. I want to know I'm going to heaven. I want him to take over my life and be the director of my life. Here's the way we're going to do it. I'm going to ask you to get up out of your seat all over this great auditorium and come and stand quietly and reverently here in front. So you come on this beautiful, wonderful evening in this great stadium and make a historic decision of your life. You come right now, quickly, from everywhere. If you're with friends and relatives, they'll wait on you. You can go back and join them after a while. But don't you turn away from Christ tonight. You come and receive him into your heart. Just get up and come now. If there's a doubt in your heart about your relationship with Christ, come and settle it tonight. Right now, quickly, hundreds of you. From up in the balconies and all around, you come. We're going to wait on you. Every head bowed in prayer. You just say, Lord, I'm willing to surrender my life to you. I want you to come in and be the Lord and master of my life. I acknowledge that I have sinned. I believe that Jesus is the only way.